I started dropshipping in 2018, near the beginning, so it's been nearly three years now. Um, what got me into dropshipping was beforehand, I was sort of figuring out ways to make money online. Um, I was you know, flipping clothing, flipping Supreme Babe Yeezys, I was you know, flipping, um, I was playing this game called Counter-Strike Go, um, and I was flipping games, flipping skins within the game, so I had experience buying and selling from a young age. Like when I was a kid, I was buying like packets of you know, share there's this thing called red skin, which is like this red lolly that you could pull when it stretches. I'd buy a bag for like five dollars and go to school and sell each piece for like 50 cents. Um, and after doing all those things, buying and selling, I sort of maxed it out, got pretty, knew the ins and out of it. It was sort of, I sort of reached the limit where it plateaued. I couldn't sell more things if I wanted to. I couldn't buy more things if I wanted to. And I wanted something more challenging. So I was on YouTube searching how to make money online as like a teenager, how to make money online under 18, and how to make $100 a day at home. And dropship came up again and again and again. And I was like, well, what is this dropshipping? Look into it, I was like, whoa, like you can make money without having money. You can make money being the middleman. And that got me hooked. Little did I know that the moment I got into it, it was gonna be much harder than I thought. And I was failing for the first six, four to six months, every single day, getting little to no results at all. And then just through perseverance, just through watching a bunch of Gary V, I was able to push through and I finally sort of found my first winning product. I guess the rest was history.